Hello, everybody. Today, you're not going to be able to see me, my face. Yes. No. <laughs> I'm here. Hello, everybody. Hello. Hey, guys, how are you? Mm, I'm fine. Hello, hello, i fine. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Hey, today we have, all of us have different, different shirt color. Look, Francisco, black, me, red, and uh, Wendy, Wesponja, and, uh, and uh, you, Juan Jose, blue. For the selection. Ah. For the selection. Yes. Sur y blanco. Sur y and, blanco. And Ruben, white. Arriba con la selección. Yeah, All right. Hello, guys. Hello, hello. It's a pleasure. It is good to see you again. Today is Friday, people. People, today is Friday. It's Friday. Yes. It's a beautiful, it's a beautiful day. Pepe, what? Pepe. Pepper mix. Patties. Ah, peppermint patties. Mm -hmm. Patty, can I have a de pollo? Pa? <laughs> no. Así dice la vida de pollo. Pa. ¿Son picantes? No. Es el pepper, es el pepper, es el chile. Es el chocolate. Sí, es el chocolate. Yo con esto, dulcito, mire. De acora. No, people. You are fine, you are perfect. And look at me. Porque vale uno, vale uno 50 la bolsa y trae como 10. Ah, ok, it's good, it's Entonces good. no salen a cora, salen a menos, ¿verdad? Bueno. <risa> no, pues sí, a cora la barra completa. <risa> All right, right. Me gusta ir a, a ¿cómo se llama? Al, al, a, lo, a Dollar City a comprar chocol chocolates con menta. <risa> Esos son feos, no, son procesos buenos. Yo tengo una cora de semita alta. ¡Ay, qué rico! <risa> tengo siglos de no comerme una. Semita alta. Esta tiene una chocolatina. Bien, de mm. okay. No, es, es, esto no es chocolate, es chacalaca. Ah, chacalaca. Más ah, rica. esta es rica también. Me gusta la de chacalaca. Sí, eso las compré a mi hijo, pero <risa> quería una, así que me las comé. Te las quité igual que a mi sobrina, las quité con yogur. <risa> <laughs> excellent, excellent, everybody. How are you, teacher? Tired? I'm tired. Today, I'm tired, people. Oh, no. Okay. I'm tired today. It's a very hard day. Oh, <laughs> Never. <laughs> Usted que no vino un día de, de, de calzón día y se quiere temprano hoy. No, 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 no. <laughs> so, it's Friday, teacher. Yes, it is Friday. It is Friday. Yes. Are you guys, are you going to drink? No, I am not going to drink. Why not? It's good people. <laughs> Wait, I am drinking coffee. Look. Sí, it is good. The Dominic like drink. Yes, yes. Ella vende y vende bebidas. bebidas. Tiene selección de bebidas. No, quien tiene selección de bebidas es esa. No recuerdo quién es como estaba la bebida. Wendy. Ah, sí, ¿verdad? Ella es. Pero de cerveza, va. <risa> Tengo tres botellas ahí nada más. Apartemos para el fin del, del curso, del cuarto mes. <risa> All right. Cuando pasemos de los, de los, ¿cómo es? Cuando pasemos de principiante a intermedio. Para la graduación. Ah, bueno, ya, ya, ya va a estar bien añejos. Ya va a estar bien añejos. Ya va a estar bien añejos. Ya no va a servir. Nunca. Entonces. Con solo oler lo van a pegar más. <risa> ah, pues nunca, no tiene fe. No, no, per, no per, pervietan a, a Rubén, que está muy concentrado. No, no, él no, no quiere saber de bebidas. <ríe> ¿Has quedado sin ganas de alguna? No, no, ok, no, no. All right. <coughs> Hello, Rubén, how are you? Are you tired? 
You look tired, sleepy. Con sueño se ve. Y cansado. Yes, I'm tired. How was your day? Yes, teacher. How was your day? It's so sore. Okay, that's good. So that's good. Yes. And are you ready? <laughs> Are you ready? Yes, I am ready. Perfect. Excellent. Excellent. Yes. Excellent. That's the attitude. All right. Excellent. Wendy, hello. What about you, Wendy? How are you? How are you? How are you? <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> um, I am um, best than yesterday. Than no yesterday. Sé si Better than yes. yesterday. Okay. Better than, than yesterday. All yes. right. Mm. That's perfect. Estoy un poco más tranquila. O sea, no ha pasado el problema y todavía es muy delicado para hablar de ello. Eh, pero ni modo. ¿Qué puedo hacer? No más estar tranquila y pedirle a Dios, ¿verdad? Nada más que, que no pase nada más las cosas. Yes, pero sí está mejor que ayer y sí espero estar al 100 en la clase en la voz. Excelente. Con toda la atención del mundo. Ok. Excelente, excelente. I'm happy for you, Wendy. Thank you. Thank you for asking, teacher. All right. Good evening. Good evening, Estela. Good evening, Estela. Hi. Hi. I'm in a church. I am in a church meeting. Church. But a church. Ah, so uh -huh. But uh, <laughs> in a moment, I will be with 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 us. I will be joining with, with us. Okay, okay, it's okay. Don't worry, Thank all you. right. Don't worry. Thank Don't you. worry. Thank you, teacher. Francisco, hello, man. You look tired. Yes, very tired, but uh, happy. With my Christmas tree. Oh yes, I can see it. Excellent, excellent. <laughs> That's premature. Okay. Yes. Declaración prematura. Okay, no sé. <laughs> 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 All right. Okay. Okay, very good, very good. Excellent. You look happy. Tired, but happy. And that's good. All right. JJ, hello, JJ. Hello, hello, teacher. How are you, Jay? I am fine. It's super tired. Really? Yes. I'm sorry, man. Uh, uh, I I had a a funny day. day a funny, funny day. F funny day. Oh, well, that's good. That's good. That's something. Una capacitación, good. una capacitación en una montaña. Sorry. Ando en una capacitación en una montaña. Really? Allá por Huayua. Allá por Huayua. Excellent. Excellent. Cool. Good for you. Por más que traje un poquito. Yuca frita traje. Sorry. Con yuca frita con chicharrones. Ay, qué rico. Sweet. Sweet. Excellent. Y la quesadilla. Ay, las quesadillas son mi debilidad. Sí. Una buena quesadilla, obviamente. Esas buenas porque son de las propias. Okay. Good for you, man. So that, is, that is excellent. That is excellent. Good for you, Juan. I'm happy for you. Thank you. Fatima, hello, Fatima. Hello, teacher. You look nice. You don't look tired. <laughs> Are you tired? Uh, a little tired. Okay. I'm happy. Excellent, excellent. That's good. That's good to know. Okay, very good. Perfect. Tell me hello, tell me. Hello, teacher. I'm fine. Why are you I angry? I had a quiet day at work. Why are you angry? What? Why <laughs> are you angry? No. Happy. <laughs> All right. Excellent. Excellent. Very good. Very good. Uh, hello, Margarita. Good evening. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Hi, how are you? Yes. Mejor? Mejor? 
Yes. Happy. Yes, teacher. Mm, yo creo que usted, usted está, está mejor porque es viernes ahora, por eso es que ha mejorado. <laughs> Excellent. I'm happy for you, Margarita. Pues sí, sí, es diferente. Thank you. Okay. Mauricio, hello. Okay, no. <laughs> Hello, Mauricio. Hello, teacher. How are you? Ah, uh, fine, fine. You? I'm fine. Thank you for asking. Are you ready for the class? Yes. Listo. All right. That's good. That's good. That's perfect. Hello, Roxana. Good evening. Welcome. <clears throat> how are you, Roxana? Hello. Hello. How are you? I'm fine. Are you happy? Are you sad? No, okay. Nelson, hello, Nelson. Good evening. Hello, teacher. Good evening. How are you? I'm fine. I'm very tired. I can imagine. Today is Friday, okay? Today is Friday. I, I understand. I understand. It's Friday. Yes, it is. And Friday. the body now. <laughs> the body knows it. Yes. The body knows it. Yes. Today for me, today for me is a casual, casual day, as you can see. Casual. <laughs> yes. All right, guys. Let me take attendance real quick here. Uh, we say that Jamilet Diaz Gonzalez is not <clears throat> yet. <clears throat> Carlos Mario Andaño Peña, no. Carlos René Rivas López, no. Did somebody say here, no. Okay, here's uh, Guadalupe Gómez, Landa Verde. Present. Fátima Gabriela Córdoba Rosales. Present. Francisco Nehemías Godínez Urquía. Present. Graciela Janet Melara de Cruz. José Daniel Menezes Bolaños. Juan José Portillo Durán. Hello, present. Juan Josué Morales Pérez. No. Mario Alexander Arteaga Campos. Ahora está aquí, es ahora está hasta acá. Nelson Domínguez Díaz Alas. Present. Noé Ortiz Carrillo. Hello. Hello. Teacher. Oscar Mauricio Montenegro. Present teacher. Reina Margarita Martínez de Castillo. Present teacher. Roxana Elizabeth Méndez Melara. Present. Rubén de Jesús Campos Gómez. Present. Sandra Elizabeth Díaz Torres. Y en Wendy Doménica García. Here, teacher. Hello. I see if we say that. We say that. Good night, teacher. Hello, hello, good evening. Okay. For the people that did that that didn't work, uh, well, this is for uh, very specific people. Did you guys finish the platform? For the ones that had not. Yes. Teacher. How do you say? <clears throat> Sorry. How do you say estoy al día? Ah, I'm up to date. Uh, me too, teacher. Repeat, please. No. <laughs> no. There you go, in the chat. I'm up to date. Okay. 
am up today. Okay, update. What is I'm, up today. I'm up to date. Or you can say I am old. Okay. Oh, sorry. Or you can say I am old. Um, cut up. Cut up. Cut up. Cut up. Go. I am. Up. I am old. Cut up. I'm, I am cut up. I am cut up. Yes. Okay. All right. Let's start here. Do you guys see the presentation? Yes. <clears throat> All right, then. Today, today in this lesson, we are going to study or we're going to learn how to use would and would like to, or just would like, okay? So again, let me repeat. Today, we're going to learn how to use would and would like to. This is class number nine. Today is Friday, November 12th. And uh, well, would and would like. That is the topic for today. And we're going to practice and learn about this. But before we go to would and would like, uh, let's review may and might. Do you guys remember may and might? We practiced this yesterday. Do you remember? Yes, okay, okay, very good. It says, it says here, we use may and might to express present or future possibilities. So we use it for two, for just, uh, for two different possibilities, right? One possibility is a present possibility and the other one is a future possibility. I was telling you that may is very formal, might is also formal, okay? But in the cases of possibilities, may has more possibility than might. Now, I was telling you as well, also I was telling you that, that we use may for possibilities, for permission, for wishes, and for prohibition. That's what we were, we were practicing yesterday, remember? And I shared this with you, remember? I shared this information with you. With the possibility I gave you, I gave you some examples, like the ones I have here. Sandra may go to the park with her family. Noe and Nelson may help the children in need. Uh, possibilities with might. I have Stella might work in the new company. Francisco might finish the inventory. Let me see this week. Okay, those are possibilities. Guys, how do you say may and might in Spanish? Podría. Puedo, right. puedo podría. Uh -huh. Okay. Okay, okay. And then we have uh, permission, which is very formal, as it says there. May I go to the restroom? May I share something? May I go to the party? May I buy with your credit card? May I use your cell phone, etc. Wishes, may you get there well? May Margarita and Delmi recover soon? May I go to your house? Well, that one is permission. May, uh, may your sister be happy forever? And then we have prohibition here with may not. Cell phones may not be used in banks and you may not smoke in class. Now, guys, we're going to, uh, you're going to give me examples with possibilities about your life, okay? Give me an example, guys. Give me an example of a possibility for the next week, please. For the next week, a future possibility, okay? Please go ahead. I may work tomorrow. Oh, no. 
Sorry, man. Me, teacher. Okay. I may have my vacation the next week. Excellent. Are you uh, for sure? Eh, ayer cumplí un año justamente de estar allí, pero hoy le pregunté a la jefa y no me dio seguridad. Me dijo que tenía hasta tres meses para pagarme las vacaciones y, y dármelas. Solo es, no me dijo sí o no. Oh, Así es que okay. como el lunes 15, podría ser que tal vez del 16 al 30 esté vacación. Posiblemente. Ok, you might, might, no me. Okay. ok, thank you. Thank you, Wendy. Might. Yes. People? Continue. Me. I might visit my parents the next weekend. Okay, I might visit my parents. Might. Okay. People, continue. I might visit my friend. Okay. Yes. <clears throat> A possibility for, for me in the next week. I might, I might kiss my ex. Never, okay. <laughs> and Ruben, you're like, no, 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 no. no. It is good. <laughs> okay. No, people. It is impossible, okay? Impossible. No, good. Así decía yo. What? Así decía yo también. Impossible. Depende. <laughs> Todo puede suceder. Yeah, it is true. It is possible. But yeah, I might. Depend. I might. Depend. Next, next, next. No. Okay. We I may. may I may. <coughs> I may. My girlfriend. Okay. Yes. I may kiss my girlfriend. All right. More examples, people. I may. I may. But. Comprar? Buy. Buy. Yes. Buy new shoes the next week. Excellent. Me too. Me too. But next month. <laughs> next month. Yes. Me too. I'm going to I'm going to use the Aguinaldo money to buy shoes for me. Yes. So <laughs> yeah. That's what I'm going to do. All right. Tell is me my blog. is my is oh. uh, buy my uniform, uniform, mm -hmm. uniform. My uniform include include in includes includes. Inclu includes shoes. Okay, very good, excellent, good for you, Francisco. Okay. Help me. Uh, Margarita may go to the dentist next week. Really? Yes. <laughs> okay, okay. Excellent. Next, more examples, people. I, I, I might, uh, I might Thank buy you. two boxes of beer. For, um, two boxes. Two boxes. Two boxes. Ah. Yes, boxes. Boxes. Uh -huh. Two boxes. Of beer. So beer. for the summer. Uh, pastillas. Ah, beer. beer. Oh no, beer. maybe it's not, it's not <sighs> box, it's case. <laughs> no, no es caja, no es caja, entonces. 24 December. Case. En ese caso sería ca case, case, case. No, no, no. Case. No sería una caja, caja de cartón, sino una, un, un case. All right. Yes. Cakes. No, two, no, three, maybe or four. Three, three, four. Uh-huh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, excellent. More examples? Hello, hello. Hey. Uh-huh. Me? Yes, yes, Mauricio. Uh, I might... No, I'm... I may mix work tomorrow. 
I may work tomorrow. Teacher, okay. eh, may me work tomorrow. I may work tomorrow. Yes, tell me. Yo puedo faltar mañana al trabajo. Mañana al trabajo. Sorry. Ah. Okay. I may work tomorrow. Okay, we lost Mauricio. Okay, Margarita, please. My brother uh, may chain home. May? May change home. Change, cambiar? Mm -hmm. change. De trabajo. Change job. Change job. Okay, thank you. More examples, people. Hello, I'm missing Sandra, Rubén. No, eh? Hi. Roxana, Briseida. Hello, Sandra. Hello. Um, I may play soccer in the park tomorrow. No, se puede golpear, no puede. Okay. <coughs> Next. I may continue the exercise with platform. <laughs> Tiene que, no, no, no podría. <laughs> okay. Teacher, teacher. Yes. I I may buy all in Friday and Black Friday. Oh yes, it is true. It is true. Okay. ¿Qué día, qué, qué día es el Black Friday? Es la última semana de noviembre, ¿verdad? O tercera. La última, creo, teacher. Okay. The last. The last week. Hay que hacer compras locas ese día. Yes. I don't have money, teacher. <laughs> I don't have money. Okay. Very good. <laughs> well, well, el sueldo que ah? enero dura como 80 días. <laughs> And... It's true. <laughs> Oh no, that's is is bad. Sabe que en mi caso me pagan a inicio de, de cada mes, me pagarán a inicio de diciembre y luego me pagarán a inicio de enero. Así que tengo que guardar dinero en diciembre para el, a la a, el fin de, de diciembre y es muy difícil. It's bad. Hay que hacer un buen ahorro. Ajá, uh, exactly, exactly. Si no, frijolitos con pan. Oh, Igual, o sea, a mí me pagan a fin de mes, Ajá. nada más. Vienen a comer a mi casa. Ok, es que está muy lejos. ¿Y el gas? <risa> Qué malos. <risa> son son sonate, va. A Cajutla. A Cajutla. Voy a contratar un bus y lo voy a traer a todos. <risa> Bárbaro. Ay, sí, <risa> Que nos, nos lleva el de Cameron ahí cerca. De despedida de año. Está así, está a siete kilómetros cerca. Está cerca, ok. Qué chido. Invitamos a Dominic. <risa> claro que sí. Pero que lleve la botella. <risa> Pero que lleve agua. Si no, no. Ardiente. <risa> agua. Only agua. water. <risa> ok. The okay. crazy water. <laughs> crazy water. <laughs> crazy water. Fatima oh. knows. <laughs> Fatima knows. Fatima knows. Okay. Uh, Carlos, hello. Hello. Can you give me hello. a possibility for, for you for the next week? Um, no, work normally. May or might? Mm, might. Okay. No, May, May, May. I think it's May. <laughs> I may work next week. It's not possibility, it's obligation. <laughs> it's an obligation. All the rest of the month. Yes, and I December think. too. Okay. In my But case, December only 15 days. All right. 
Are you guys? Are you guys? Uh, are you guys going to have vacations in December? Yeah. Yes. How many? No. Days? Sorry, Wendy. Mm. How, how many days? Quantos días? Um, um. Me one week. Okay. Good. Excellent. Una semana. Yo tendré dos semanas libres, así que. Mm. Yo estoy en temporada yeah. alta. Mm -hmm. Yes. All right. Guys, thank you for the example. From 15 December to 2 or 3 January. The second or third of January. Okay. That's good. That's good. Excellent. Two weeks. All right, guys. Oh. Let's continue here. And uh, let's go. Let's go to page 25. Open your books on page 25. We're going to go to that part right now. Let me stop sharing this because I haven't opened the book yet. Just hold on, okay? It's, the book is still loading. Mm -hmm. Twenty five, okay, page twenty five, people. Are you guys there? Yes, okay, yes. very good, very good. Let me just go to that part right now. Okay, here we go. Uh, today it says. I will be able. I will be able to request, request, and give refunds due to bad service. Guys, what is due to? I will be able to request and, and give refunds due to bad service. The video A, okay. El objetivo del día es seré capaz de solicitar y dar reembolso debido a mal servicio o pésimo servicio. Okay, very good. Then we have question number one or part one that says, let's start. What options would you give your customer if a product you order is not in good, on good conditions? What options would you give your customer if a product you offer is not in good conditions? That is the question. Change the product. All right, all right. That's what we're going to do in this moment. Let me st let me stop sharing, and I'm going to give you I'm going to give you some some uh, problems in the chat. Okay, let me see. So, soy he cortado el, el audio, teacher. Really? Okay. Then I think your internet is, is having problems. Auto. Rice authorize with Okay, in the chat, if you go to the chat, you will see some information that I have shared with you. I have five problems, people. Five problems in the chat. Okay, yes? 
It says the new cell phone is broken. One problem. Internet problems, another problem. Credit card not authorized with withdrawal, another problem. Smart TV black screen, problem. Hotel room not clean, problem. Okay, let me tell you here. El primer problema es que el teléfono nuevo está roto. El segundo es problema de internet o de Wi-Fi. Y el tercero es un retiro no autorizado de tarjeta de crédito. El cuarto es que la televisión tiene pantalla negra o se llama pantalla negra. Y el último es que el hotel, el cuarto hotel no está limpio. Ok. You guys, you guys are going to give one solution. Ok. Select one problem and give it a solution. Elijamos un problema cualquiera y démosle una solución y luego compartimos esa solución. Ok. Teacher. Yes, hello. Siempre utilizando may or my. No. Ok. Vamos a usar este que le voy a presentar en este momento. Ahí en el chat lo voy a poner. Ah, wool. Mm -hmm. Luego les explico qué significa o cómo se usa wool. Ok. Hey, what do you do and the team for low? <laughs> Mientras ustedes hacen eso, déme tomar agua, ok? A second, give me a second. Are you ready? Are you guys ready? Yo no, tengo la primera. Yo tengo un problema con la computadora, teacher. Oh, guys, guys. Estoy en el celular y no puedo abrir las dos cosas para estarla viendo porque se, se me puso a actualizarse esa cosa. I understand. Guys, solo van a elegir uno entonces. Solo uno van a elegir. Solo uno y la solución. Okay? Eso es todo. Cualquiera de los cinco van a elegir, solamente uno. No todo. Eh, no, lo puede, no lo puede poner en la pantalla, teacher. Las preguntas. Las preguntas o los problemas. Los problemas. ¿Qué es? Can you see them? Los pueden ver. Just choose one, okay? Choose one and give that problem a solution and that's it, only one.
Me teacher number one. Uh -huh. New cell phone is broken. Solution, I would, would offer another phone that is in good condition. Perfect, excellent, yes, okay. Teacher. Yes. De la última. Yo mm -hmm. le puse, I will change the guest. The guest? O, yes. o the, room, the, the room. Eh, como el, yo cambiaría el huésped. O, eh, por otro huésped. No, the, the room, o sea, I change. Ah. Move. Eh, no, no, cambiar move. sería cambiarlo de, de cambiarlo a él. Sería move, Ajá. moverlo. Ajá. Ah, pues, I will move the room. Move the guest to a different room. Ah, ok. Ajá. Ah, ok. Yes. Teacher, yo la, yo la hice, I will change your room. The room, the room. It's ok, it's ok. Ajá. Yes. Le, le cambiaría su habitación. Uh -huh. That's okay. Okay. Who else finished? ¿Quién más terminó ya? Para que... Thank you, Juan José, de Nelson, y thank you, Fátima. Córdoba. Anybody else? Share. Teacher, ¿es una breve, una breve solución o es una explicación? Una oración, una oración simple, así como la que, la que puse acá. No sé si la puede ver. Dice, Hotel room not clean, I will offer the person a better room. Teacher. Yes. Me, teacher. Ok, tell me, Wendy. Uh, new cell phone is broken. Mm -hmm. I would like to bring it for another like it. Another? Like it. Can you please repeat? I would like to change it for another like it. Like it. Another I like. Another I like. Another I like. Uh -huh. Okay, tell me. Um, internet problem. I will, I will shut the problem, report it to technician, and fix, fix it. Okay, okay, there you go. Hi, teacher. Hello. Uh, internet pro uh, problem uh, to help you with the problem you have to reset the modem and you will get an update. Okay, okay. Thank you very much, Jose Daniel, for, for sharing that. Aha, uh -huh. more people. Ruben. Yes, Wendy, tell me. Uh, uh, internet problems would like restart the router. Okay, okay, all right, all right, there you go. Let's continue here. I haven't heard from Ruben, Mauricio, Margarita, Sandra. Hello, Carlos. Yes, Ruben. I will explain to the person that the cell phone is warranted and that can get another. Uh -huh. That's a good one, that's a good one, perfect. Yes, thank you, Ruben. Uh, more examples? No? Um, and credit card not authorized? Authorized. We travel. Okay. Uh, I will block your car and, and I will refund. Okay. Okay. I will block the car and I will refund. The money, okay, okay, good solution. Very deep, very uh, simple solution. Okay. Me teacher. Yes, Francisco, hello. Uh, hotel room not clean. Uh, I will change a different room 
and offer a better, a better price. Uh -huh. Okay, yeah, that's good, that's good, very good. All right, more people, Carlos, Griseida, Sandra, Roxana. Hello, teacher. Hello. Uh, problem with uh, internet. Uh, I go, I go disconnect and turn connect. And I would call me to the yeah. operator or company internet. Okay, there you go. So there you go. Teacher. That's okay. That's okay, no Me, teacher. Wait, Mauricio. Sandra, go ahead. Hello. Uh, internet problem. I will change the internet package. I will change the internet, sorry. Package. Agency, la agencia. Ah, okay. Agency, all right. All right. Mauricio, no. Okay. Uh, new, new cell phone is broken. Mm -hmm. uh, the, the house. In the web wheel, changer the cell, the cell phone. I would change the cell phone. Yes. No, repeat. I would change the cell phone. Change the cell phone. All right. Very good. <clears throat> we're going to stop here and we're going to continue because we have time limitations. Let me just stop sharing here. And we're going to continue here. Okay, we finished with this one, with part one. All right. <clears throat> now that we have uh, practiced a little bit with wood, now I'm going to sh show you, I'm going to show you how we really use wood, I mean wood. Okay, it's here. Okay, how to use wood and wood like. Okay. okay. Sorry, my. Okay. Wood, acá está. Wood plus base form. Usamos wood con la forma base del verbo. Okay. And lo mismo pasa con would like to. People, what is would in Spanish? Quisiera. Haría. Haría, quisiera. Me gustaría. Gustaría. <coughs> Cree que puedo. <laughs> Guys, would in Spanish, no es, no es, me, uh, bueno, sí, me gustaría, si would like. No, no es haría, no es ni quisiera, no. El would es la terminación ia en cada verbo. Ok. Muchos dijeron, I would change, cambiaría. Ok. No sé qué más, qué más dieron ahí, uh, no recuerdo. I would block, dijo, no, dijo Nelson, I would block the credit card, uh, bloquearía, ok, en la, es la termina, terminación ia en cada verbo que se usa, ok, cada verbo es, eso, eso significa, ok, ejemplos, I would eat, comería, I would drink, uh, bebería, I would watch, yo observaría o, o miraría, etcétera, 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 ok, yes. En el caso de would like, si tiene su, su, uh, su, su, how can I say this, uh, a specific, a specific uh, translation in Spanish, well, uh, like es gustar, so entonces would like, gustaría, okay? Yes. All right. Let's just start. It says here, would plus base form, would like to plus base form. Guys, one thing, we use wood to make a request. 
Ok, usamos el would para hacer o preguntar o hacer más bien una solicitud, lo cual es una pregunta o un favor. And the question is, would you open, look at the example there, would you open the door, please? Would you open the door, please? Abriría la puerta, por favor. Ok, guys, one thing here. Wood, wood is very, very, very super formal. Okay. Yes, it's very, very formal here. Super formal. Or you can say it's very Very polite. Okay, I'm going to leave it there. Okay, again, would and would like to is very, very polite. Okay, polite is educado, right? Let's continue. It says, would you help me finish the report? Would you help me finish the report? Guys, in Spanish, would you help me finish the report? Yes, Sorry, me ayudarías. Uh -huh. All right, all right. It's very, very polite, people. Very polite, very uh, with a lot of education, or very, uh, yes, very much, very formal. Okay, this is para hacer una solicitud. Let me see. Uh, like I said, solicitud is like a favor, es un favor. Okay, es como un favor, la solicitud. Usted le pide a alguien hacer algo por usted, right? That's what it is. So we use would. Uh, ¿Se acuerdan? Hemos usado también este, este can, could. No sé si se acuerdan para, para can y could. ¿Se acuerdan? También se usa para, para solicitud. Ok. Pero el que es más formal, incluso más formal. Bueno, se puede decir que son, son iguales con could. Pero podríamos decir que would tiene un poquito de más, más de nivel de, 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 de formalidad, formalidad que could. Ok. Yes. All right. Let's continue here. All right. To extend an invitation. Para, usamos would para extender una invitación. Is it, would you like to come to my house? Would you like to come to my house? Te gustaría venir a mi casa? Would you like to come to my party? Te gustaría venir a mi fiesta? Okay. That's, you are extending, you are extending an invitation. Would you like to come to the reunion? Would you like to come to the graduation party? Would you like to come to my baby shower? Would you like to come to my divorce? <laughs> my divorce party? <laughs> yeah. Okay, et cetera, right? Guys? Do you understand this invitation part? Yes? Yeah. All right. Okay, okay. Then we have to ask for permission. To ask for permission. Would I be able to go home early? Would I be able to go home early? Okay. Sería capaz de irme a casa temprano? Okay. You are asking for permission in a very, very polite way. Okay. Yes. Would I be able to go to the bathroom? Would I be able to go drink some water? Etc. You are uh, asking permission or asking for permission here. To ask for preferences. Guys, para preferencia usamos el would like. Okay. El would like. Acá está. Would like, okay. Is would like, would you like tea or coffee? ¿Te gustaría la, el té o café? ¿O le gustaría café o té? Would you like a salad or the main dish? ¿Le gustaría una ensalada o el plato principal? Okay, yes. All right. Then it says to make arrangements. Guys, what is arrangements? Arrangements? 
preparativos. Preparativos o planes. Ok. Ok. Yes. Es como decimos a uh, Francisco, ¿qué día, es, ¿qué día está bien para usted? Digamos que se quieren, se quieren reunir a, a comer algo con alguien y decimos, hey, ¿qué día te, te, te sale bien? Entonces ahí usamos el, el, el would, ok. To ask in a very formal way. Would Friday be okay for you? El viernes estaría bien para ti. Would, the next would next month be okay for you? El siguiente mes estaría bien para ti. Okay. Yes. All right. Then we're going to rewind. We're going to rewind. To make polite offers. Guys, to make polite offers. Para hacer, ofer, uh, ofrecer algo educadamente. Now. Would like, would like. Okay, as you can see there. It's would like. It's just made it smaller. Hold on. Would like here. Is very is very common is very common in restaurants, in restaurants, okay. And look at the example. Would you like to drink water or juice? Le gustaría tomar agua o jugo. Would you like to see the menu again? Le gustaría ver el menú una una vez más. Okay. Yes. Note. We use would with all subjects. Okay. Usamos would con todos los sujetos. Okay, sin ninguna alteración a would o al verbo. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Sorry. Okay. It is questions time. Guys, do you have any questions? No, teacher. No se queden con dudas, ¿ok? Teacher, ¿podría, podría repetir el, eh, to make arrangement? Arrangements. Eh, eh, sí, en, 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 en español, por favor. Uh, no, no. <risa> Solamente donde dice, will Friday be okay for you? O sea, ¿qué significa en español? Ok, let me tell you. Es cuando... Usualmente cuando invitamos a alguien a, a un lugar, le decimos, ¿qué día te sale mejor? Pues nosotros hacemos una oferta o, o hacemos la, la propuesta de, de, para preparar la, ya la, la salida y decimos o preguntamos a la persona, ¿qué día te sale mejor? ¿Te sale bien el, el viernes? Entonces ahí usamos el would. ¿Would Friday be okay? ¿Te sale bien el viernes? ¿Would next no, Monday sí, podría... be okay? Eh, podría ser, eh, no, el viernes estaría bien para ti. Ajá. Yeah. ¿O te saldría bien el viernes? Y el siguiente es, ¿Will next month be okay for you? ¿Te saldría, te saldría bien el siguiente mes? Ok. Ok. Yes. Thank you. Guys, more questions? Para decir así como, ¿Cuándo podrías? When would you? Or when could you? When could you? Cuando podría, dice. Sí, cuando podría. Could, when could, when could you? When, when could you? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. More questions? People? Ask me. ¿Cuál sería como la fórmula, ticha? La, la base. La estructura de cómo va. La estructura. De la oración, dice usted. Sí. Yes. Ya la veremos, aquí no se preocupe. Oh. En, la, en las tres formas. More questions? No question, ticha. You are sleeping. Es que ayer no dormí, por eso. Sorry. <laughs> no, questions? All right then. 
Do you have examples? Can you give me some examples? Just a few examples, three or four examples will be okay. Anybody? I will do anything for love. Haría todo lo posible por el amor. Roll right into hell and back. No, no, no. I wouldn't do, I would not do anything for love. Ya yeah, no, okay. El amor no. It is song. El amor it is no. song. Meet love. More examples. It's meet love. Meet love. More examples, anybody else? Alguien más? I would like go to the sleep. I would like to go sleep. Okay, sorry, but you can't. It's not possible. I'm sorry. Guys, what examples? Um, would would you? I don't know. Did you say something, Fatima? I couldn't hear because your microphone is off. Oh, sorry. Would you like to mountain or beach? Mm. Okay, would you like to go? To go to mountain or beach? I would like to go to the mountains. Mountains is good. Yes, Sandra, you were giving me an example, but I, can, I couldn't hear you. Okay. Um, would you like to come eat with me? Come. To come? Eat with me. Drink, eat. Eat, comer. Okay. Would you like to see the Lord of the Rings again? Yes, I would, of course. I'm going to watch it. En vacaciones lo volveré a ver. En vacaciones. Many times. Las seis películas voy a ver. La del, la del uh, COVID también. The last weekend I saw the first three. All day, all day. Yes. This weekend I will see the next three. Excellent. The man. Hobbit. Yes, good, good for you. I'm showing those pictures to my daughter. She like it. The movies. Uh -huh. Guys, I have a question for you. She's in love. She's in love with Legolas. <laughs> <laughs> I can imagine. <laughs> would it be would it be okay for you guys if the if they change the teacher? At this moment, no. At this moment, no. Would, would it be okay for you if they change the teacher? <laughs> no. 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 Estaría bien para ustedes si cambiaran No, teacher. No. Por mí sí está bien. A mí que me pongan. Bye. See you. Bye, forever. <laughs> Sorry. All right, guys, excellent. Now, let's go and now we're going to see the structure. The structure in the affirmative, negative and questions. So be ready to take notes because this information is very important. And with the information you will be able to write down or to create sentences, okay? Oh, something I, for, I almost forgot. Bueno, aquí se lo voy a poner en esta parte. No, no se puede. Okay. No puse la firma en la afirmativa. Okay. Entonces pues aquí lo voy a poner, la estructura. Sorry. That's a weird, I forgot, man. La estructura para afirmativos, the structure for affirmative people is this one. Aquí la voy a escribir, okay? It's the subject plus would plus
look, I have I, I've just given you the structure there. The structure for the affirmative, subject plus would plus verb plus complement, subject plus would like, would like to plus verb plus complement. Okay, that's how, how it is. Okay, let me just separate these two to write down some examples. Look at this example. She look, she would open a new business. Okay, abriría un nuevo negocio. Ella abriría un nuevo negocio. That's the structure, la estructura. Después del would, pueden colocar cualquier verbo con tal que tenga sentido o lógica. Puede ir cualquier verbo en su forma normal. Nada de S, nada de ING, nada de pasado. Okay. Here. Teacher. Yes. Tengo una pregunta. No es, no es referente al tema. Creo que ahora me toca quedarme a mí después de clase. Y quería ver si puedo cambiar con alguien. Mm. It is not possible. No. Porque... Sorry. Ok. okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> Sorry, Sandra. Ok, no problem. Se quiere dormir antes, ¿verdad? El que a mí que quiere dormir rápido. <laughs> All right. No, no, está bien. <laughs> All right, guys. Questions right now about the structure in the affirmative. Eh, teacher. Yes. Yo, yo hice una oración donde ponía you will drink beer on wine. Ajá. Eh, ¿Está bien o, o necesitaría el like to? Can you repeat, please? Eh, you will drink beer or wine. No, es correct. Tú beberías, tú beberías uh, vino o, I think o, o cerveza. Cerveza. Drink beer or wine. Si ahora quieren hacer una pregunta, tiene que ser al revés. Would you like to drink beer or wine? Pero si es afirmativo, no problem. Okay. Yes. Pero entonces, esta es pregunta, la última. Acá no hay preguntas. Bueno, lo... Esto dice, you would like to drink wine? No, no, no. ¿A ti te gustaría? Solo, solo, solo lo, lo, lo expreso. Ah, ¿a ti te gustaría beber, beber vino, verdad? No es una pregunta. ¿A ti te gustaría beber vino? Es como que yo dijera... Beber. Es como que yo dijera en ese momento, hey, me gustaría comer unas pupusas de queso con frijoles. No, no, no es pregunta. Yes, people. Queso con frijoles y loro. Perfección. Es que yo creo que a ese te gustaría beber vino, le falta. A, a ti te gustaría beber vino en la cara. Sí, porque ¿sí? si fuera I would like to, sí, pero es you would. Por eso suena más como pregunta. Así suena. La cuestión es que el would se usa con condiciones en, en muchos casos, con una condición. Y si entramos en condiciones, nos metemos en una, un tema muy difícil. Entonces, ahí mejor nos quedamos acá, en esta parte, sin normal. Porque si diría, you would drink wine if you went to a party. Tú beberías, beberías, uh, beberías, ¿cómo se llama? Vino si fueras a la fiesta. No, no, that's, that's complicated. Okay. Me teacher. Hello. Me teacher. Yes. Uh, for example, 
You would like to drink a cool beer. Yes, thank you. Yes. All right, very good. See you, huh? Examples. Yes. <laughs> yes, Delmi, ask me. Francisco would like us to go to this home. Okay. Yes, okay. Okay, very good. Let me erase this information here and let's continue. Let's go and let's continue with the next, oh, sorry. Also, it's very common, it's very common to see the contractions with wood. The contractions with wood are very common, people. Very, very common. Okay, and that's how you continue. I've, solo ponen la T al final. I've, you've, she'd, he'd, id, you'd, we'd, and they'd. Right? Ese es para la, contra, para la contracción de, de, del sujeto con would. Okay? Very good. Here, negative form. El negativo está con la estructura y entonces hay que de un solo. Ok. Here. How to use would, wouldn't, and wouldn't like. Wouldn't. Ok. Uh, the structure, the structure here, as you can see in the presentation, the structure is subject plus wouldn't plus verb plus complement. I wouldn't eat all food. Ok. Yo no comería comida vieja. You wouldn't drive without a license. No manejaría sin una licencia. You wouldn't dance that ugly music. No, bail no bailarías esa música fea. You, sorry, he wouldn't go to the beach alone. Él no iría a la playa solo. The situation wouldn't change at all. La situación no cambiaría en absoluto. We wouldn't be part of this bad, of this bad, of this bad action. No seríamos, no seríamos parte de esta mala acción. They wouldn't work overtime without extra payment. No trabajarían um, overtime in Spanish. Tiempo, no, no. How do you say eh, tiempo extra. Tiempo extra. Right? Tiempo extra. Eh? Sí, tiempo extra. Horas extra, no sería. Horas extra, pero tiempo extra. Ajá, lo mismo, casi. <laughs> ok. Ellos no trabajarían horas extra sin un pago extra. Ok. Very good. Y usamos el would not, okay? Would not, or in, in this case is contracted, is wouldn't, wouldn't, okay? Uh, to be honest, people, to be honest, would not, would not is not very common. Es formal dejarlo sin contracción, pero es más, mucho más común escucharlo y verlo así como hasta acá en negativo. Wouldn't, okay, wouldn't, or wouldn't like, yes. Oh, now, here, subject plus wouldn't like to plus verb plus complement. I wouldn't like to go to a restaurant alone. No me gustaría ir a un restaurante solo. You wouldn't, you would not, <laughs> lake, lake people. <laughs> the mind, sorry, my bad. I wouldn't like to run at night. No me gustaría correr en la noche. She would not like to see her ex. A ella no le gustaría ver a su ex. Delmi and Jose wouldn't like to eat rats. Uh, Delmi and Jose no le gustaría comer ratas. Okay. Yes. But I don't know. Would you like people to eat rats? 
No. Bien frita. No, teacher. No, like. <laughs> Ni cuenta de cada uno. Ya va, ni cuenta de cada uno. Ya. Sí. A ver cuántas veces. En, ¿En Perú es un plato tú? típico. Un tipo seis, A ver de dónde. En Perú. Ah, bueno. No. Delicious people. Solo Shrek come ratas. Esta página aquí. Como la naquita, tatuajes por todos lados. Va el terzo. Es rebelde. Me falta la pantorrilla ahorita. Ok, good for you. A ver si uno aquí ve. <laughs> Mauricio is fantastic. <laughs> All right. Bombastic. <laughs> Carlos Mauricio. <laughs> Guys. Do you have any questions? Oh, esa parte, esa parte que está ahí en azul en la, al costado es muy importante. Dice, wouldn't is used when you want to imply that something is not advisable or, or optional. Eh, eh, people, wouldn't es usado o el would en negativo se usa cuando quieres o cuando uh, imply en español. Insinuar, cuando se insinúa que algo no es aconsejable o u opcional, ¿ok? En el caso, I wouldn't, I wouldn't eat all food, no es aconsejable comer comida vieja, ¿ok? Yo, yo no comería comida vieja, no es recomendable o, o aconsejable, o no es opcional, ¿ok? Etcétera, 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 right? Yes. Ok, now, everybody, ready for the example? Please, bombard me. Guys, teacher, excuse me. Eh, en las letras azules es yes. correcto la palabra nor. Oh, está yes. equivocado. Yes, yes. It's correct. It's correct. ¿Y significa? Ni. Ni. Good. Good. Wooden es usado cuando tú quieres insinuar que algo no es aconsejable ni opcional. Ah, ok. Thank you, teacher. Yes. People, questions about this in the negative form? Eh, yo sigo perdido, teacher. O sea, ¿cuándo vamos a utilizar el would y cuándo vamos a utilizar el would like to? Es, es, es prácticamente lo mismo, solo que el would like to se usa más que todo en restaurantes. Cuando, más bien el would like to se usa cuando usted quiere ofrecer algo a alguien. Okay. Okay. Si es pregunta, pero si esa no me gustaría, por ejemplo, no me gustaría comer comida china. Pero es prácticamente Delicious. Es casi lo mismo, ok. More questions, people? No question, teacher. Okay, no, let, teacher. let's say, let's, now you, you have to give me examples in the negative form, ya sea con uh, would or would like to. Okay. I want to go to USA. I would like or I wouldn't like? Uh, en negativo. En negativo. Yes. I wouldn't. To like to go to like to I USA. Would, I wouldn't like to. I wouldn't like to. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't like to go USA. Go to the US. <coughs> US. Why, why, teacher? All right. Why US? Estados Unidos. Pero ¿por qué no USA? No. No es necesario. No. Es más común. Okay. El, es más común US. US. Ok. Yeah. Mi teacher, my example. Mm -hmm. I couldn't go to the another country alone. 
Okay, I wouldn't go to another country alone. Okay, okay. People, continue, continue, people. Musician. Yes, you are here. I, I would not, not like to work very late. Okay, Maha. I wouldn't like to work very late. I wouldn't like to work tomorrow. <laughs> but you have to, man. I'm sorry. I mean, Me? we have once on once a month only, but <laughs> <laughs> I don't I, want. I, I don't want. He said more examples, people. I wouldn't <laughs> like to go soya pango. Soya pango. Okay. Guys, let me give you an example. Francisco wouldn't like to be in the class today. <laughs> Observe <it long>. alone. <laughs> what happened? Relax. Tell me, please. Tengo un, fuerte, tengo un fuerte dolor de cabeza. Really? Yes. No. Why medicina? Okay, I'll go to medicina. Okay, tell me, give me an example. <laughs> Malo. Sorry. Wendy wouldn't like to, ta to dance right now. Okay. Wouldn't like to dance right now. People, more examples? No? Don't I give me teacher. Because... Yes, Sandra. No. Okay. I will, I will not uh, work tomorrow. Okay, I wouldn't work tomorrow, okay, but you have to work tomorrow. All right, Fatima, yes. The teacher wouldn't like to go to the party. <coughs> I don't, I don't like parties. Okay, no. <laughs> Mauricio, yes, you were saying. I would not like to go to China. 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 Well, uh -huh. All right. Guys, no more examples? No. Okay, then. I wouldn't like good tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> we would like to work tomorrow. I'm sorry, Rene. It's our obligation. Yes. For tomorrow, I would like I would like to have an easy day, but it is not going to be easy. It's going to be very difficult. Yes. Yeah. And I will, but well, in this moment, I would like to have my baby with me, but my baby is with a. Uh, his mother, yeah, sad. Yeah. No, never, never. All right, guys, let's continue here. Look, questions, questions, questions. Would the question for the question we change the position of the subject in would would plus the subject, plus the verb, plus the complement. Usamos el would antes que el sujeto, y luego el verbo y el complemento, okay? Así es como se usan o se hacen preguntas. Would you help your sister with her homework? ¿Ayudarías a tu hermana con la tarea? Would Elmer go to the store right now? ¿Iría Elmer a la tienda en este momento? Would she go out with me? ¿Saldría ella conmigo? Okay. Yes. Uh, then we have would plus subject plus uh, like to plus verb plus complement. Acaso un poco diferente. Tenemos el would antes que el sujeto, luego like to, luego el verbo. Okay. Separamos el would like to y, y metemos el sujeto en, en medio de would y de like to. Así como, así como sacamos, lo ven acá. All right. And the example is would you like to order? Te gustaría o le gustaría ordenar? Would you like to eat? Le gustaría comer? Would you like to have? Le gustaría tener? Would you like to buy? Le gustaría comprar? Would you like to try? Le gustaría intentar o probar? Okay, that's how it goes. 
The Gran Azul dice, eh, would like to is commonly used in restaurants, hotels, stores, etc. Este would like to es com comúnmente usado en restaurantes, hoteles, tiendas, etc. Okay? Para ofrecer, hacer una oferta bastante formal. All right. Guys, would you like to ask me questions? No, teacher. Teacher. Yes. Would do you like to vacation? Repeat, please. Would do. Would, would you do. like? Would you like to vacation? Would you like vacations? Or would you like to have vacations? Yes. A vacation. Yes. Today, tomorrow, and forever. Vacation dos veces al año. Que dure cada seis meses, cada vacación. I am going with you. <laughs> okay. Algún día me ganaré la lotería, vamos a trabajar ya más. Ok. O pondré sí, todo sí, en, Bitcoin, en Bitcoin. En Bitcoin. Okay. <ríe> All right. More questions. Mientras estoy trabajando. Ay, 30 bolas, ya son 55. Uh, yes. Guys, more questions. Okay. Yes, Sandra. Well, you like to sleep now? Yes, I would like to sleep now. Or yes, I would. Okay. More questions, people? Teacher, would you like to speak another language? Yes, I would. I would like to speak, uh, not French, I would like to speak German. I like German. Super. Yes, I'm actually, I may, I may, see possibility, I may learn German or study German next year. It's good. Me enseña, por favor. No. Please. <laughs> All right. Nice. Let's say her teacher. Her. <laughs> Guten Tag. Guten Tag. Buenas noches es Guten Nacht. Guten Nacht. Tuve un, bueno, tuve un amigo alemán que me enseñó eso. <laughs> Guten Tag. Guten Morgen. Guten Morgen. Yes. Ah, sí. The get is the... Uh... Eso sí no sé qué es. <laughs> ¿Cómo, cómo, ¿Cómo estás? Ah, ok. Ok. Guys, very good. Here. Sí, ma. Se va un bonito en francés, ¿cómo estás? Teacher. No, se va. Yes, Sandra. Do well, you like it proposes now? Yes. De hecho, tengo, tengo en la red de congeladas, no pupusas. Delicioso. <laughs> All right. Bien. Guys, everybody, let's, let's uh, work on this part over here, ¿ok? Trabajemos en esta actividad unos un minuto le voy a dar. You are very intelligent. Let's work, work on the activity, okay? Let me check the time. Okay, it's ahora. Eso es lo último, okay. Let's work on this part, okay? Let's work on this. Go, go. Individually, yeah. Later we check later. Excuse me a moment, please, just a minute.
I'm back. Did you finish? No, teacher. Sandra, hello. You're sleeping. Yes, it's a sorry. <laughs> it's okay. La 8 es para todos. Pregunta 8 es para todos. The sad truth. <laughs> <laughs>
Did you guys finish? No. Yes. Guys, you finish. No. One note, two millions. <laughs> two million. Guys, you finish? Okay, let's check people. Let's check, let's check because it is this time. We are number one, number one says, I'm thirsty. I would like a glass of water, please. Number two, a volunteer. Me, teacher. Go, go, go away. Sorry, <laughs> Daniel. Seria, would you have? Would you have a break? Mm -mm. Guys, different answer. Would you like a break? Would you like a break? And the answer, people? Yes, we would. We like. No, just we would. Okay, just we would. Daniel, read number three, please. Patrick, go, go to the supermarket. Patrick, go. Go. go to the supermarket. Or Patrick would like to go, okay? Both are correct. Yes. Number five, no, yes, number three. You see number three. Number three, anybody? I don't understand this. I don't understand this. I would like help with my. 
Okay, I would like some help with my homework. Okay, thank you. Number five. Let's see, Ruben, number five. Oh, no, not for me, not this. <laughs> okay, it's okay. No <laughs> okay. Uh, cuatro, you... teacher. Tengo oh. una pregunta, teacher. Okay. Uh, ask me. En la, en la número dos, la que yo respondí, este, la, la respuesta de eso dice, yes, we. Uh -huh. Pero... O sea, si dice que hay, would, would you like to a break? Porque la respuesta es we. Es, es you plural. ¿Les gustaría un receso? Sí, nos gustaría. Uh, ok. Mauricio, mm. yes. Mauricio, yes. Uh, teacher, excuse me. Cuando yes. se debe entender, bueno, la verdad es que según el momento, ¿verdad? A quién se lo están diciendo, si se lo dicen a una o a varias personas. Ajá, exacto, exacto. Podría, ahí por la respuesta se entiende de que es a varios. Uh -huh. Ok. Ok. Mauricio, hello. La, la cuatro o la cinco. Ay, la cinco. A cinco. Ok, entonces la cinco es. A ver, mamá. A, a good. Cool. Tom. No, good you, Tom. No, good Tom. Good Tom. Uh -huh. Like call me to the practice this weekend. Ok. Uh, would come like to come with us. With us. Yes, he would. Number six, people. Anybody? Anybody? Guys, number six. Can I you can I help you? Yes. I would like a ticket to Melbourne. No, no problem. Uh, number seven, Rosana, do you finish it, Rosana? Rosana is sleeping. Okay. Sandra? No. Why? Number, la trece. Seven. <laughs> seven, seven. <laughs> okay, my friends, I would like to uh, come to the party next week. My friends would like to come to the party next week. Yes. We're going to, guys, we're going to stop here because we need to do something else. It's colored. Yes. Okay. Okay. Hello, everybody. Here. Um, you see the book, people? Guys, you, you see the book? No. Um, Guys, do you see the book? Venga el libro, no? Si sí, eso está en el libro. Y si ven el, ven el libro. No, teacher. Solo en la pantalla. Si a la izquierda de la pantalla, lo veo ahí en el celular. ¿Es a eso a lo que se refiere, teacher? Ya lo compartí, no, no, no. no lo, ¿Lo pueden ver ahora? Yes. Yes. Ok. Vamos a la parte número 5 porque el tiempo se nos ha avanzado. Acá está la parte 4 es would, how to use would and would like. Estos son los ejemplos. Y luego nos aparece el número 5. Vamos a ver. ¿De qué fue? 
Vamos a la parte 5, entonces. ¿Qué le pasó? Dice, un gol de Salvador. ¿Qué están jugando hoy? Ah. ¿Sí? Ah, ok. No sabía. El Salvador, Jamaica. Ah. Estoy muy... ganando el Salvador. Sí. Estoy muy desconectado del fútbol en este momento. Tengo... Después de que me lesioné, no quiero saber de fútbol. Aquí en el estadio, Cucatlán, están jugando. Dice el que dijo, vamos a hacer la actividad número 5. Yes. We're going to work on part 5. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Part five, okay. Let's complete part five. Uh, If you have any questions, I'm here. You can ask me. Feel free to ask me. Teacher. Teacher. Uh -huh. Voy a conectar el celular porque se me está descargando. Entonces se va a ir. Se va a escuchar un, un ruidito ahí. Okay. Ya no tengo mucha carga. Okay. En la seis no es no es mundo es wood okay autocorrectora eh. o oh, no sé si <laughs> okay. bueno de hecho es wood Eighty-six. Um, yeah, twenty-six. Okay. Covid. No. Did you finish, people? Okay, let's let's check. In number one, it says, uh, "Well, people, this is an activity libre." Okay. Those are different, or the questions are different. 
Ruben, can you read number one? Hello, teacher. Hello. Read number one. I would like to visit my family tomorrow. Okay, I would like to visit my family tomorrow. All right. Uh, let's see here. Margarita, can you read number one? Um, la tres, la tres tengo, teacher. Okay, okay. Eh, will, will she be in the meeting? Okay, will she be in the meeting? All right, all right. That's okay, that's okay. Very good, thank you very much for sharing. Uh, Carlos. The second one, Carlos. Avendaño? Yes. <laughs> okay. Mr. Trujillo won't, wouldn't like to work tomorrow. Okay. Mr. Trujillo wouldn't like, Emma Trujillo, ¿se acuerdan de Emma? <laughs> wouldn't like to work tomorrow. Acabo de recordar de Emma. Okay. Se fue Emma, ¿verdad? Yes. También, ¿cómo se llamaba la otra muchacha? La de Santapeque. Amanda. Ajá. Carlos también. Tobar. La mamá de Jonathan. Mr. Tobar. Ah, Yesenia. 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 ¿Qué pasó? Ya no entraron en este ciclo. I don't know what happened to them. I don't really know. Fátima, can you read number four? Uh, will like to travel. I cannot see the example we like okay we like to travel very good very good uh number five daniel can you read number five she wouldn't bring uh, drink coffee okay she wouldn't drink coffee let's see over here Like she's still driving. JJ, can you read number six? Sí, no la estoy. Se ha negado. All right. Uh, Nelson. Would you like to um, Chinese food? Would you like, repeat. Would you like to eat? Chinese. Chinese food. All right, very good. Thank you for your participation. So, uh, unfortunately, we couldn't continue with part six because part six is very interesting. It's a writing, writing activity. It says write a fine line paragraph about what you would do in case a customer wants that the refund due to a bad service or product she or he paid for. Y se escribe un párrafo de cinco líneas acerca de qué harías tú en caso de que un, un cliente hiciera el reembolso debido a un mal servicio o producto que ella o él pagó. Okay. Solo tenemos tres minutos para esa parte. Three minutes. People work three minutes quickly. Comédase, comédase en máquina. Es parecida a la primera que hicimos. Richard. Exactly, exactly. Aunque la primera solamente era una oración.
Y mientras ustedes se salga, eso ya va a ser con la asistencia para que aprovechemos el tiempo. Ok. Briseida Yamilet Díaz González. Creo que ya no está. Se estuvo. Carlos María Vendaño Peña. Here. Carlos René, uh, René Rivas López, no. Delmi Guadalupe Gómez Landa Verde. Present. Fátima Gabriela Córdoba Rosales. Present. Francisco Nemia Jolín Turquía. Present. Graciela Janet Melada de Cruz no estuvo. José Daniel Meneses. Daniel. Juan José Portillo Durán. No. Juan José Morales no estuvo. Mario Alexander ¿Ah? Campos ahí está. Sí, 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 sí. Maura Alexander. Maura Estela Orante Fernández. Nelson Domingo Díaz Alas. Present. Noé Ortiz, Ortiz Carrillo. Oscar Mauricio Montenegro. Presente. Reina Margarita. Presente. Roxana Elizabeth Méndez Melara. Rubén de Jesús. Presente. Hello, hello. Presente. Sandra Elizabeth Díaz Torres. Bien. En Wendy Doménica Garcia. I'm your teacher. Yo present teacher, me levanté a tomar agua. Yes. Guys, did you get it? Yes. Did you need a paragraph? Excellent. Okay, Fatima, es la voluntaria. <laughs> I will give you a discount and I will apologize for the misunderstanding. Apologize. Apologize. Okay, okay, there you go. Excellent, excellent. Mauricio. Okay. A Pauline J. and Change the product. I would, in... I would apologize. Ah, uh, pera, pera, pera. I would, I would, I would, the Pauline J. I would apologize. <laughs> I go a Poland die and change change in change the product the product okay there you go excellent e e and go I go invite Jim Brown to the story sorry no Just the first, the first part is correct, okay? That's the part is fine. Anybody else? No? More people? No? Me? Okay, JJ, and then tell me. I will apologize. I Apolo will give you Apologize. 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 I will give you other option. I will offer a discount on the product that you want. The reference. I will exchange it for a similar one. Okay. And then me. We finish with Delmi, okay? We finish. I could speak. I could speak with the client. I would ask him if he would like to exchange the product for a new one or if he could prefer a discount on his next purchase. All right, thank you very much. People, thank you for joining the class today and thank you for always taking the class into consideration. Thank you for this week. Guys, I will see you the next week, people. Take care, 
be safe, drive safely, don't drink. If you drink, uh, be careful as well, okay? And guys, I will see you the next week, okay? Have a great weekend with your family, friends, and anybody around you. See you guys. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night, everybody. If you are going to drink and drive, drink water. All right, there you go. Thank you. <laughs> if it's beer. Okay, feliz noche. No salgan de casa y no tienen que salir. Thank you. Bye. Close on that. Questions? Oh, I'm sleeping. <laughs> Questions? Preguntas, dudas, quejas. Preguntas. Sí, tengo preguntas sobre un tema que, que ya lo vimos y lo, lo repasamos esta semana y como que no terminó, no terminó como que siendo match como que no no lo captó uh -huh. es como que es era cuando usamos eh, para para plural y singular pero que era un singular this ¿Cuál? Los, that. No, era para lo que se puede contar y lo que no se puede contar. No recuerdo eso. Se tiene que acordarse de todo. Ah, era for months. Sorry. How, how, how much y how many? How no, many? Okay. Ajá, eso. Ya me acordé. Ok. Si usamos how many en forma plural. Ok, sorry. En plural, bueno, más bien, how many con un objeto o con algo plural, después de how many. Okay. Ah, pero, ajá, sí, solo quiero decirle algo. Lo que me confundió es que a veces se entendía como que estaba hablando de varias cosas, pero no se usaba, o no sé, no sé, pero no se puede usar el plural, sino que se usaba el singular. Por ejemplo, litro. Ah, ok, ok. Ok, muy bien. Vale. En, en el caso de, de, de how many, le decía, le comentaba que se usa para cosas que son plurales o que se pueden contar. Okay. En el caso de how much, how much, acá lo puse a la par de, de how much, que se usa para cosas que no se pueden contar porque hay cosas que, que, que existen que no se pueden contar. Un ejemplo muy claro es el agua. El agua no se puede contar. ¿Okay? No se puede contar. Y en ese caso se usa how much, pero sí se puede contar el recipiente donde, donde usted pone el agua. Entonces, en ese caso, como usted dijo, litro, litro sí se puede contar. Se puede decir uno, dos, tres, cuatro, no hay problema. Entonces, en ese caso, la palabra litro sí funciona en how, much, en how many, pero no en how much, porque es litro. Si es el agua, entonces sería en how much. Ok. Lo mismo pasaría con, con digamos, el oxígeno. El oxígeno no se puede contar. Ok. ¿Y si fueran litros de agua? ¿Perdón? ¿Si fueran litros de agua? Si se fuera, 
si fueran litros, se, se, se puede contar el litro, no el agua. Uh -huh. Y obviamente usaríamos how many, porque es plural, litros, cuántos litros. Pero okay. si es solo agua, agua en general, usamos how much, cuánta agua bebes al día, o cuántos litros de agua bebes al día. ¿Vale, comentaba? Uh -huh. Perdón. Uh -huh. Solo que si se pone a, a pensar, cuando, cuando pregunta cuánto, cuántos litros de agua tomaste al día, es como que se estuviera contando el agua, porque se hace la correlación del contenido del recipiente. <risa> es cosa mía que es donde yo me confundo. No, no en, ese caso, en ese caso no contamos el agua, contamos el, el recipiente, ¿ok? Es como una botella, un balde, una copa de agua, un vaso de agua. Se, lo que se cuenta es el recipiente, no el líquido. Okay. Otro ejemplo puede ser el, el oxígeno. El oxígeno no se puede contar, pero sí se puede contar el cilindro. No, no, no está, no está el, 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 el oxígeno. Tres cilindros, cuatro cilindros, pero el oxígeno no se puede contar. Okay. Otro ejemplo, Ticha. Oh, otro ejemplo sería, digamos, la harina. No se puede contar la harina. Okay. No podemos decir tres, hari tres harinas, cuatro harinas. No no. Se puede. Pero sí se puede, contar, se puede contar la libra de harina o el, el saco de harina, la bolsa de harina. Eso sí se puede contar. Bolsa, bolsas, sacos, sacos, libras, libras. ¿Como el maíz? El maíz sí se puede contar. Mi granito se puede contar, ok. Pero igual, sería como el maíz en general, cuánto maíz. Uh -huh. El que se puede contar es el grano, el granito de maíz. Uh -huh. Ok. Más ejemplos okay. podría ser, otro ejemplo podría ser de algo que, ah, el azúcar. No se puede contar el azúcar, ok. No se puede contar el azúcar. Entonces, la libra sí se puede contar, el quintal se puede contar. Ok. okay. Todo lo que va con, todo lo que se puede contar va con... How many? How many y todo lo que no se puede contar va con how much. Así es, así es. Si en dado caso usted quiere cambiarlo de how much y ponerlo en how many, entonces incluyale el recipiente, ¿ok? Y luego lo pasa a how many. Si lleva el recipiente, si lleva el recipiente entonces lo pone en how many porque... El recipiente sí se puede contar. Si omite el recipiente, entonces va en how much. ¿Ok? Gracias. Pero que solamente esa pregunta tenía. Ok. That's ok, that's perfect. Ok. Si no hay más preguntas, no vamos a dormir porque ya se va a dormir. Yo creo que este, la cédula y eso la cámara no se me fue. Perdón, no la escuché. O oh, no sé. <ríe> es que está Estela. Es que vamos manejando. Ah, por eso. Pobrecita, está de vida para el día que está en su trabajo. Sí, es bien tarde y aún sigue manejando. Va para su casa. <ríe> y te, eh, tengo otra pregunta. ¿Cuándo finaliza el módulo? Ah. Uh, no tengo el calendario acá. Déjeme que no me acuerdo. No me acuerdo la fecha, me no acuerdo si sé qué día es, el lunes, el lunes 29. El lunes 29, o sea que estamos a dos semanas, llevamos dos semanas de clase entonces. El 15 sería, la, el, el lunes sería una ya la segunda semana. Porque semana? recuerda que faltamos un día, el 2 no hubo. Mm, ok, entonces llevaríamos dos semanas, el, el, el 15. Ajá, el 15, que es el lunes. Luego el 22 es otro lunes, la, y luego el 29. Sería el 29 de, de, de este mes. Y en diciembre sí, igual descansamos, o sea, no tenemos clase. Me imagino que darán la pausa del mes, todo el mes completo. No creo que, den, que, que sigan con el módulo y pues no se pausen esos días, no creo, lo dudo. Van a dar un mes, digamos, todo Me imagino, el creo que sí. Creo, no estoy seguro, no sé la verdad, no puede decir que sí. Posible. Okay. Pero, ¿qué otra pregunta tenía? 
No, pues creo que solamente ahí estamos. Okay. Entonces, it is time to sleep. Yes. I would I would like to sleep right now. Okay. <laughs> mm. Bye, teacher. Okay. ¿Cumplimos? ¿Ah? ¿Cumplimos con el tiempo? Yes, it's okay. It's okay. Thank you, Sandra. Okay. Ya tengo otra pregunta. Yes, yes. Llevo uno, él lleva un día clase y llevo dos, no, tres clases que he entrado tarde. ¿Cree que eso me puede afectar? Yes. Pero en, si lo amarramos por horas, ¿cuántas horas son las permitidas que no puede faltar para que... Para uh, des, desconozco ese dato. Lo recomendable es que siempre se conecten antes, a la hora, siempre a las 8. A las 8 se esté conectado. Sí, pero ¿cómo hago cuando no puedo? Es que pienso de que mi teléfono, o sea, digamos que vengo tarde de trabajo, en mi teléfono yo no me puedo conectar porque es un... Es un Huawei, entonces no me agarra la aplicación Zoom, no me la acepta, no me la reconoce porque no, no tengo, ¿cómo se llama? Google. Uh -huh. si sí, no tengo eso, no que yo tengo la tienda Huawei. Entonces hay muchas aplicaciones que no me las, no me las reconoce, no me las corre. Ah, entiendo. Entonces se, se conecta con la compu. Sí, yo solo con la compu. Digamos que no puedo hacer lo que está haciendo usted la ahorita, que viene en su carro manejando y, y él con, con, con la cámara de salir y todo, porque yo no puedo ingresar a la aplicación. Ni tampoco puedo ingresar por medio de un link. Porque como no tengo en sí el, el acceso o, o la licencia para usar... Google, ¿Y la compu, la, la compu se la lleva para su trabajo? No, es de escritorio. La ah, que okay. es. Ajá, entonces por eso yo no puedo, o sea, cuando vengo tarde, ni no, me ingreso hasta que vengo acá. Entonces, por eso. ¿Y qué pasa? Y, y si no cumplo con el 80%, solo no, no paso el módulo y me toca que repetir, ¿o cómo es? Um, esto no fue dato. En ese, ese caso, si el, por el tiempo le afectaría, porque como... Inglés corporativo quiere que la gente esté siempre activa. Si, la, si, si se ve que la gente no está activa, es como que a la gente no, no le importa, no le interesa aprender el aprendizaje. Entonces, si ven que una persona ha faltado demasiado, 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 lo que ellos hacen es, pues, obviamente, la quitaría para meter a alguien más que esté interesado, que sí quiere aprender. Okay. Okay. Bueno, a ver. Y... Look at the chat. In the chat. Hola. Ah, ok. Yes. Eh, ah, ok. Mm -hmm. All right. Bye, teacher. Goodbye. See you on Monday. Thank you. Ok, bye bye. Bye. Estela, ¿me escucha? Can you hear me? I am still driving. All right. We, we finished the class, Estela, okay? Yes. Yes, I know, teacher. Okay. Good. Very good. Thank Manero. you. Con cuidado, okay? Con cuidado. Cuídese mucho, okay? Thank you, teacher. Y, y cierra, cierra y llame las, 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 las puertas del carro, okay? Thank you, teacher. Está complicado. Así que cuídense mucho, ¿ok? Muchas gracias, igualmente. Nos vemos el, vemos el día lunes, ¿ok? Feliz fin de semana. Bye bye. Igualmente. Sí, Chao. Thank you. Thank you. Bye bye. Thank you.